Hey guys, welcome back to uh, Half-Life 2, where last time we, Alex got captured, uh, and now we're going on our way, to, continuing on our way to the Citadel, uh, I guess to rescue her now, amongst other things. So yeah, we're uh, continuing along. I don't really have much to say, because we just started the episode. Okay, into the, the tunnels again. A lot of Half-Life 2, I just realized, takes place in tunnels of some sort. Kind of interesting. Alright, now... Yeah, the gate opens, but... I don't know why I stopped here for a second. I stopped here for something. Ow. And I can hear man hacks, my favorite. Yeah, pretty. And uh, you're gonna need the gravity gun a lot down here. Uh, nothing over here looks like other than some barrels. I feel like they give you those barrels. For I feel like those barrels are for like if a barnacle shows up or something, but I don't see any barnacles, so. Oh boy! My favorite enemy in this whole game, man hacks. Since the floor is dirt, I guess the the walls are what you should knock the man hacks into. And get rid of my, uh, get those barrels down so we can do this. Ugh, get out of my way, boxes. Oh, I think I'm stuck on the pipe. Yeah, you're supposed to get up here. Very, very simple. Once again, I've said this before, I don't really consider this to be a hard game of any sort. Just, uh... A very intriguing game. Or not intriguing. What the hell am I talking about? It's not a, a hard game for the most part. It's just... There are some parts that are a little bit frustrating. But overall, the game is not hard in my opinion. Oh, crap. Hello? Where'd you come from? Oh, now the floor is sturdy enough to destroy them. And you get over here and die. And there's nothing down here, it looks like. Oh. Except that, but I want to check what's over here first. Looks like absolutely nothing. Except for a dead guy. Uh, poor bastard. Oh, and a med kit. And some soup batteries. Never mind, there is stuff down here. I'm just a fucking idiot, as usual. Okay, uh, where do we go? Ah. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Combine. A lot of them, Jesus. Luckily, I needed to reload the exact same time they needed to. And my SMG is still pretty low on ammo. Well, there goes that. Guess can't you- Oh, that's a zombie. Never mind, I thought that was a combine. Uh, uh -oh. I don't know why I'm still using the SMG, considering I should probably conserve ammo for it. Though they are, they do start giving you enemies that actually carry it again. Oh, hi, Lambda Catch. That one's difficult to get to, actually, because it requires a bit of uh, strategic platforming to actually reach. Where do we go? Oh, jeez. Yeah, this isn't fun if you're not good at platforming. Because you're... It's difficult to maneuver around without falling off of something. Get down there. I said get down there. Gordon! Gordon! Okay. Ah, ha. Ah. Okay, yeah. You can... You can go down the ladder. Apparently I never got to this lambda catch, though. I can remember doing this one. So I don't know why it says I didn't get this one before. Maybe I never got it and managed to survive, because maybe I fell. But yeah, for the longest time, I didn't know where to go here, because I'm an idiot, as usual. Uh, crap, I think it's the level, a level below us, actually, that we need to go to. Yeah, it's the level below us. Yeah, okay. Now 
go in here and immediately chuck a damn grenade in there. Or not. Or just th do that. I could just do that instead. But yeah, the first time I went in here, I got caught by that damn thing. So, dead guy. I don't really see how he got killed. Maybe the poison egg crab got him or something. Yeah, lift that off. And now the doors are open. So simple, and yet I fuck it up a million times. Oh, hi. Okay. Yeah, you can probably kill the soldiers. The zombies are not at all threatening. The soldiers can actually be pretty damn dangerous if you... Wah! That was close. Yeah, there are a lot of poison head crabs down here. Ah! Okay, I just crowbar this guy because I really don't feel like switching to another weapon. Ah! Yeah, remember I said there are a lot of poison hangers. Oh, this. This is so mean. Watch. Watch this. They're all dead. Valve, go fuck yourself. <laughs> Valve, go fuck yourselves. Seriously, that was just mean. I'm gonna let this barnacle catch me because I don't even care. The barnacles are not threatening either. Maybe they'd be threatening if, like, their bites did more damage, or if you couldn't use- or if you couldn't get at the angle to use the crowbar on them. I can hear that damn poison head crab, and there's another one over there, which I'm just gonna mag them to death, because I don't- I don't give a shit. And there are a lot of friggin' zombies and barnacles down here. I don't know why I did that, because that's not going to do any damage, because it's not the uh, shot with the gravity gun. Oh, will you just die? Oh, crap. Ah! Uh. Uh. <laughs> Stupid. Will you just die already? Uh-oh. I... Hi. Okay. This is a little interesting. Lamb the catch here. You have to use the, the gravity gun to grab them. Yeah, you see? You see what I mean about so many poison? Thingies down here. Where the hell are you? Get back out. I know you're not dead. Oh, oh. Never mind. I guess uh, I killed it. I guess two crossbow bolts is all it takes. Uh, but I still hear his damn poison head crabs. Where are you, little babies? Where are your little babies? I can hear them. I should not have wasted a magnum. Uh, I don't know what magnum bullets are for anything like shotgun shells or buckshot or something like that. Whatever. Okay. Yeah, uh, that's done. And then I proceed to be in. Oh, never mind, that one's dead. And there's a ladder here. I took forever to notice that. That's where you were! Shit. I hate those damn things. Uh, thankfully, we're not going to be running into too many of them after this. Although there is another one right there, as soon as I say that. Any more? No, I don't see any more. Ah! So many head crabs! Going uphill. Uh, huh. Yeah, it doesn't look like. Oh, pipes, right. So many pipe puzzles. Half Life 2. Oh, crap. Uh, yeah, blow these up because if you don't blow those up, the combine are going to try to blow them up while you're going across, and that will most likely end in your death. I think when I was playing this uh, before I started recording, yeah. grenade! Crap. Haha, <laughs> dodged it though. Screw you, Combine. I'm better than you. 
By the way, blow that up too, because that otherwise that, they're probably gonna try to blow that up when you go, because you have to go on that thing. Start bringing that down here. And uh, prepare for a bit of a fight. There are a lot of combine down here. Luckily, apparently Gordon can shoot through um, a chain link fence with a crossbow. Uh, so yeah, that's kind of cool. Amongst Gordon's various other skills is shooting, able to shoot through a chain link fence with a crossbow. barrels off here, by the way, because they're going to just get in your way. If you can get them off, because they're, they're kind of... Stupid guardrails are blocking me. Off. Off. Now, uh, once it gets close enough... Did that do it? Yeah, yeah, it did. Yeah, yeah. Once it gets close enough, jump back on and uh, turn it back, and then it'll start heading back on. But there are still people shooting at us, so be careful. And uh, these ones are a little more difficult to hit because this thing is kind of wobbly. And uh, even without the uh, barrels on it, it can be kind of well. I think that might have actually been my fault, though, when I shot the exploded barrel. guys are a bit difficult to hit with the crossbow or the magnum, the two sniper weapons on these because they move around a lot. There's a lot of enemies that just sort of tussle around here. Okay. Uh. Oh, hi, elite. Uh, yeah, the elite really aren't, as m aren't any more challenging than the regular combine, but they're I guess they're so. I suppose they're more challenging just because of the fact that they can shoot the laser shot, which does do more damage than the bullets if it hits you. Though it's never going to hit you if you just keep moving. Oh, and then this guy. Oh, he already pulled it. Never mind. I thought maybe I could stop him from pulling the switch, but I don't know what happens if that hits you, but I, I don't want to test it. Although, this isn't Half-Life 1, where touching a rail kills you. Gunfire coming at me and it's down there. I'm out of ammo for this thing again. Wow. Huh. Throw these barrels off. Back here, we'll land the catch with a laser shot and some health, but I don't need that. I don't need either of those, because I'm at full health and I'm at full ammo for the laser shot. And, uh, get out of my way. Alright, uh, yeah. Oh my god, more mines! Okay. Alright, that's done. Dr. Freeman! Barney said you were on the way. We got split up by snipers, and he's pinned down on a warehouse up ahead. Go ahead. He's relying on you. Oh, great. More snipers. Uh, my favorite enemy in this game. The fucking snipers. Wait for me! Dude, you're gonna get sniped. Uh, there's really 
not a whole lot of cover out here. Cause, like, that's the best you're really gonna get. Ow. I know where he is. Oh. Oh, except, guess what? This isn't like the last time you thought the snipers. There are still two snipers. Or maybe more, there's more. I can't really tell. And for some reason, the gravity gun can't just break the glass. You're Barney's old friend, aren't you? Maybe you can help him. Snipers trapped him up on that warehouse roof. He was going for a cache of grenades, but I doubt he can get to them now. Go on, Dr. Freeman. Hey, get some health. Save in this room because the snipers. Are, well, the sniper will kick your ass. Oh, wow, she managed to make it by hitting me again. So, another head crab. You know, I'm not even gonna bother with that one. Jumps back at me. Of course. Alright, uh, yeah, I think we'll deal with the snipers, uh, in the next part. We're getting to the end of this recording. Oh, great. Really? I deal with you guys again? And of course, I don't hit the head crap. Hi. Okay, yeah. Uh, we'll, we'll deal with the snipers next time. So, see you guys next time. Bye-bye.